On this episode, we are going to talk about golf, weddings, and Pinterest. Exciting. Hello, and welcome to episode 34 of Tip for Tip, where you ask your marketing question in exchange for a tip in your industry. My name is Aaron. And my name is Christian. And today we have Eric Hoyle from Heritage Ranch Golf and Country Club. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Eric Hoyle. I'm the Community Events Director at Heritage Ranch Golf and Country Club. And my question to Aaron and Christian of Bit Branding is, how do we become more visible to people and let them know that you do not have to be a homeowner at Heritage Ranch to take part in some of our facilities, which includes golf, food and beverage, and outside events, including weddings, anniversaries, and birthday parties. Let's take weddings, for example. If we try to figure out who is the target market behind weddings, it's gonna be 90% women, or even 100% maybe. Right. Um, so you need to capitalize on that. So where is that audience? Uh, number one place that comes to mind is Pinterest. And girls and ladies who are about to get married, uh, they're researching Pinterest up and down. I mean, they're pinning things, they're pinning ideas, event locations. So that's a great way to be online if you're wanting to do wedding events for your location. Right, and I did, did get married even before yeah. we got engaged. She was pinning thousands of pins of not only the event, but dress, etc. You want to be there before they're there. And you can actually do that on Pinterest by advertising to people who are interested in getting married. More than likely, they're either about to get engaged or anticipating it for their husband, or they just got engaged because they keep pinning stuff. And you can run advertising to them. Right now, we're seeing conversions on Pinterest because there's not a lot of competition a penny per conversion. So you can spend a little money and find out a lot about your audience. Mm -hmm. Then niche it down to whether it's, you know, weddings. We talk about weddings specifically, but right. any mm -hmm. type of event that you want to have at the Heritage Ranch, you can niche it down and find out where, where's your audience at and what platform makes sense. Is it Instagram? Is it Pinterest? Right. Is it, uh, you know, Facebook? Whatever it may be. So niche it down and spend time where your audience is at. And spend some money advertising. Yes, yeah, spend some money. It doesn't cost a lot of money. It's actually pretty cheap. But yeah, you're gonna have to spend some money. All right, Eric, let's see your tip for us. My marketing tip for you today is, remember, you are the best source of advertisement for whatever business that you have. Always promote yourself. Whenever you're talking with somebody, please remember that you never know what the hot button is that's gonna make them want to do business with you. You never know where your next customer is gonna be. So remember, Always let people know what you do and where you work. That's your best source of advertisement. I'm Eric Hoyle with Heritage Ranch Golf and Country Club. That's a great tip, Eric. And to add a little bit onto that, and Aaron and I were talking about this, is to add value to whatever you're telling people that you do and be prepared and have a business card as well. Yeah, I think that's huge. But I mean, you hit the nail on the head as far as so many people you just get in conversation. It's normal conversation to have with people, but you need to always be telling, I mean, yeah, add the value, but mm -hmm. your brand is there and it's, it is yourself. So no matter how, what we said earlier about advertising, that's one avenue, but yourself, that's the biggest one. So thank you for that tip. I know we needed that. We need to focus on, on knowing our stuff too. Mm -hmm. And for those of you who would like to know more about the Heritage Ranch uh, golf course, all you can do is, uh, no, you can't do that, but you can find all the information uh, above in the description. Christian's gonna put all that information for you. And if you are a business owner who would love to come on the show, all you have to do is go to bitbranding.co forward slash tip for tip. Now that's the end of tip for tip, but we did our business plan this last weekend, and this is spur of the moment. These guys don't know that I'm saying this, but we are gonna do a 5K at the end of the year next year so just be thinking about that. Um, sponsorships, opportunities, but we wanna get the community involved, involved here in Allen. So if you're watching it this far in, just kinda look a, a little Easter egg. We'll see you guys next, next week. week.